Well, here we are in beautiful Victoria, day one of the Western Engineering Competition. We've got seniors, juniors, innovative design, consulting, and communications. Now let's head on over and check them out. So senior design is it's the one of the main cap, main competitions for the Western Engineering Competition. It's this one is for the upper level students, uh, generally third and fourth year students, and it involves using a robotics kit. Uh, it requires an advanced, somewhat advanced knowledge in engineering, and it also requires that they actually commit themselves to fully understanding what the challenge is. The challenge itself this year is, as I designed it, is a forest that has been sort of destroyed by pine beetles. So what they have to do is clear cut part of the forest, uh, taking away all of the pine trees, uh, as well as the other trees that they find in the area to reduce the fire risk. Uh, the competitors have no preparation at all, uh, other than learning how to use the VEX kits. Uh, they have their own special, well, specific programming language, sort of, uh, so it takes a little bit of getting used to, and then familiarizing yourself with the kit is a little bit of the preparation. But other than that, there's not much preparation you can do other than coming to the competition ready to work. Two, one. That's all the robots? Hold up. Yes. The center of the weight in our, in our machine is over the drive wheels, which means that the, that the freewheeling part is very light. So we started with actually two 15 hole seat channels rather than this uh, 25 hole that you see. So it was, it was quite a bit shorter as well. I actually didn't feel any stress. It was it was an interesting challenge, and uh, I, I felt that uh, we were more into the design rather than counting hours. We as a team were meeting a few times in school to strategize about this competition and, uh, and make sure that we have a solid plan. It ended up being so vague that we had a good uh, system to adapt to any situation, and it worked out really well. Selling their LNAPL. 50 cents a gallon. Oh yeah, okay, so what can it be used <laughs> for? Oh right, that was the other thing. What we can possibly call companies and people who specialize in this stuff. Start basically picking the brains of engineers out there. They actually lock us in the room with the three judges and we have 20 minutes to basically convince, convince them, sell them on our idea. Which is what we're great at. <laughs> so you guys are all done? Congratulations. Yes. Yes. How does good. it feel? Relief. <laughs> Spectacular. We don't have to worry about having to present anymore. But we did, we ran through it this morning and it went pretty well. And I kind of got freaked out because the timer said 11.50, but it was counting down. But. <laughs> what BCIT did prepare us for was the hard work and the train and the aptitude to learn something new within six hours and deliver a clear, concise presentation and solve a problem that we'd never seen before and had really no understanding of, and that's what BCIT prepared us for. Here we are, day two of the Western Engineering Competition, and Senior Design has taken over the entire lobby. Tons of people waiting to find out what these engineering students have been up to the last couple of days. We're in the innovative design category with our single-wheeled motorcycle trailer. It's very exciting. We're looking forward to present it here shortly. It's got many features that we're going to be pointing out. It's got steering, it can fold up, it has a braking system, it can haul mountain bikes. It's just great and very exciting. How do you feel now that you're all done? It was kind of anxiety and nervousness before? It's, it's a good question. We just uh, spoke to this with one of our colleagues, but it's, it's one of those feelings where you, you're, there you have so much anxiousness and anticipation and excitement leading up to one thing, and in an instant it's gone. So now we're in that wind down process, letting all the, ang all the adrenaline pump out of our system. All in all, it felt really good because we were up pretty late practicing and uh, we wanted to make sure we hit it in one run and, and we're really effective. And coming out of the presentation, we all feel that we did very well. That's why we really put our heart and soul into this so that we could go to nationals. But here's what I can tell you. As a North American society, we are becoming asynchronous. We are moving towards an asynchronicity, which means that people aren't necessarily working it's still Monday on Tuesday or Wednesday. Thursday. All I got from it was, Thursday is now the new Friday because we can get cheap rips. I, I should invite them to Kaylee's downtown in Vancouver and Kaylee Street. The opposition, um, again, you guys are very natural, easygoing speakers. I met you guys yesterday and you're, uh, you're very kind of 
You're very confident people, I can tell. Uh, it took a while to gather some steam. It's the first debate of the day. Hopefully we can dodge a bullet on this one, get lucky, and, uh, and, and hopefully take away a win here and move on to the second round where we can open up a little bit stronger at the beginning. Because it took us a while to get going, and it took us a little while to define our points properly. So this is the first test, first practice. How are you guys feeling? Uh, a little nervous for now, but we're pretty confident. It, it was looking like it was good on the table, so hopefully it'll be good on the track. Very exciting. <laughs> I can't really speak much, but very exciting. I'm hoping it rolls straight, and that's all I want. Take the risk of being Work with this uh, popsicle stick before, so we know that it's rollable, and, and that's what we want. Like I think. I think it went pretty good. We, we brought quite a bit of weight up there. I mean, it'd be nice to get a little bit more, but it definitely it went nice and straight, which was one of our biggest concerns. So, yeah, perfect. Yeah. For our first place in Innovative Design this year at WEC 20, 2013, that's what year it is, um, we had the uh, BCIT. The <laughs> That's it for us here at WEC 2013. BCIT did fantastic. It's off to nationals for some of them. Lots of celebrating happening today. And now we're just going to have to wait and see what happens in 2014.